This Saturday is the largest single day food drive in the country. And there's another lofty goal for collecting this year. Joining us now is Bob Chetmus from the Second Harvest Heartland to tell us more about Stamp Out Hunger. Bob, thanks for coming in. It's my pleasure to be here. Thanks for having me. So 25 years, you make this so easy for people to give food. You really have no excuse. I know I got my bag in the mail yep. this week. Tell us a little bit about how this works. Well, for 25 years, Stamp Out Hunger has been a hunger relief effort by the National Association of Letter Carriers working with food banks across the country to collect food that gets distributed out to food shelves and food pantries um, in local communities. So <clears throat> the carriers working with Second Harvest Heartland will pick up food from communities, put it in their truck, and bring it back to Second Harvest Heartland and we'll distribute it out to hungry people. And when you say carriers, you mean uh, postal workers? With I the mean US postal, postal workers. Postal sure. service. And these are the bags that people can expect to possibly get that these they could bags, fill or a today, paper bag. Today or tomorrow, you'll get this bag or a paper bag in your community. And what we ask you to do, we've got a couple of sample products here, all packaged goods, is take some of those and put them in the bag. You right? make it so easy. It yes. is so, well, letter carriers make it easy, but it is easy. Put it in the bag and then set it by your mailbox. Which set is it. important to not have perishable food in there. No perishable food. No perishable food. With a food forecast, no ice cream that will not last. <laughs> exactly, exactly. Set it by your mailbox and the letter carriers on Saturday okay. will pick it up and uh, they will bring it to Second Harvest Heartland and we'll take care is of the rest. Is there any food that you are most in need of right yeah, now? Yeah, what's your biggest need? You know, proteins. Okay. So you see peanut Beans. butter and you see tuna and you see things like mm. that. Protein items are really good, but also um, any shelf-stable item that uh, can be cooked in the home are items that are acceptable for this food drive. And I understand you're getting a big match donation from Lando Lakes? For people who choose not to donate food, okay. uh, please feel free to go to our website, to the number two harvest.org, and there you can make a cash donation in Lando Lakes, a great partner of ours, will match the first $25,000 uh, that is donated online and we'll turn that into $50,000. So that's wow. very exciting for us too. What is it like for you to just to see the contribution that people have on this one particular day? Because it really is such a massive event. This one particular day is our largest day for food donations. We get more food donated on Saturday than we do any other day of the year. Our goal this year is 1.2 million pounds, which is a wow. lot of food. Mm -hmm. And it's very exciting to see it all come in and uh, to see all the sites gather the blue bags collected, bring it to us. It's thrilling. All right. Well, now yeah. it's time to do your part. Stamp Out Hunger again is this Saturday. If you'd like to donate now or volunteer at Second Harvest Heartland, we do have information on our website. You can find a link at WCCO.com. Thanks so much, Bob, for coming in and good luck with the food drive. Thank you.